A person who lives simply and economically, prudently saves and is not wasteful, can be called frugal. The definition of frugal living changes from person to person. We can look at it as finding creative ways to save money while living below our means. So, let's get started. Number 10. Don't buy drinks. Never buy bottled drinks. You're wasting your money by paying mostly for the container and shipping the heavy water part of the drink. Plastic bottles pollute our planet and are dangerous to wildlife. Make your own tea, lemonade, soup instead. Number 9. Use the library. Get as much out of your local library as possible. Usually libraries have everything from the obvious books and magazines to the fun stuff like puzzles, video games, and to truly random items. If your local library is not that great, figure out where else you have borrowing privileges and check them out. The best part is everything gets returned, so less clutter in your house. Number 8. Check your fridge. Know what is in your fridge and cupboards. If you don't know what you have on your hand, you may overbuy or rebuy things you don't actually need. Buy non-perishable items in bulk and on sale whenever possible. Number 7. Learn how to cook. Learn how to cook and pack your lunch. Buying a lunch every day is god expensive. Eat out or take out very rarely. Plus, going out to eat no longer makes sense when you can make everything better by yourself and at a fraction of the cost. Number 6. Maintain everything you own. You should learn how to repair your stuff so you'll almost never need to pay someone to do the work. There are plenty of videos on YouTube teaching how to DIY, so check those out. Number 5. Forget ignore any pay raise. By forgetting or ignoring any pay raise, it means that you put the excess of money into your savings. You're already used to that lifestyle and it will not be painful for you to cut on something you didn't even have or need before. You can consider slightly increasing your fund money to treat yourself, but always stay within reason. Number 4. Wait before any unplanned purchase. Wait 24 hours before any unplanned purchase. It will help you to check whether it's a true need or a simple want. You may wake up next morning and realize that you don't even need that item and you have only considered buying it because it was on sale. It goes without saying it that you shouldn't buy things that you don't need even if they are cheap. Number 3. Minimalism By adopting minimalistic lifestyle, you choose to not have access and use everything that you already have. This attitude turns you into a mindful consumer and every purchase that you make has thought and purpose behind it. Number 2. Cut down on expenses mindfully. Cutting down on your expenses mindfully means that driving around for the cheapest gas and cutting coupons won't help you much if you have a huge monthly truck payment when you don't actually need a truck. Number one, use what you have before buying new. Do you really need that jumper only because it has a Mickey on it? Or is it because you would otherwise be naked? Don't buy new until you've completely used what you already have. And there is a bonus tip. Cut your kitchen sponges in half. There is nothing a half of a sponge can do that an entire sponge can. What about you guys? Do you have any specific tips or tricks for frugal living, please don't hesitate and share those below in the comment section. I will look forward to read your comments. Bye!